talk about everything Play music in between Tune in and enjoy Chad's underground scene Talk, talk and music You know what I mean Tune in and enjoy Chad's underground Hello, it is Chad and you are watching Chad's Underground Scene. This is the South Bay Special Edition. We are going to start with some old, old clubs that used to be here. This was the site of Mi Casitas in the uh, late 70s or 80s. This was a happening club. It's now a uh, gas station at McDonald's. Lots of great bands played here. It was so awesome. And next door was Palos Verdes Bowl. We're going to go look at that. This here is now <laughs> what was Palos Verdes Bowl. And uh, big mess. We played there for about four years on the first Tuesday of every, every month. First Tuesday every month at PV Bowl in the Lounge. Another place with lots of local bands played. Very awesome. Now it's an Aldi store. And off to the next location. All right, here we are at Pete's Place. This is where Big Mess has played quite a few gigs and uh, Shillelagh Brothers. Even Easter has played here. It is now the Blackthorn Pub. Pete's Place, and also known as Pete Spratt's Tavern. We'll go around the back and see what's going on back there. The awesome front door. Next door, cool little karaoke club. Been in there as well to do some fun karaoke. It's called the Astro. Here we are in the back of Pete's place, or uh, Blackthorn Pub. Spent quite a bit of time hanging out right here. Smoking area. <laughs> this is where everyone goes out back to get fresh air, hang out, and tell some tall tales. And they are set up for outdoor dining. And in case you didn't know, this area here is for uh, drinking, loitering, and soliciting. So make sure you do all of that right in this area, in the parking lot. Okay, here we are in downtown Torrance. The world famous, the Crest. Thousands of bands have played at this bar here and restaurant. It is awesome. It is a great location, great place. Has supported the underground scene for years. Love this place. Okay, here is the location of the famous Toves Tavern. Played here many times in the 80s and 90s. Played here with the Beat Farmers. That was one memorable night. The Beat Farmers. It was awesome. 
loved Toes Tavern. Right here in Redondo Beach, Toes Tavern. Still looks the same, beautiful brick building. The stage was right behind here. Awesome. Here we are at St. Rock. Lots of shows here. I played here with the babies, played here with Flock of Seagulls, played here with Young Dubliners. And this one here. Look closely. for sale. Gonna miss this club. And if you go directly across the street, you will arrive at Hermosa Saloon. Another club of mini bands. Saloon. Famous doors going in. Nobody on the side right now. Let's wander in and go out back and check it out. Okay, we might as well play a couple songs while we're back here in the back of Hermosa Saloon. This one here is called Jimmy. Night. 
Jimmy, oh Jimmy What's that in your hand? A switchblade or a bottle For a flower for your girl I said Jimmy, oh Jimmy Bottle in your hand Let's drink that pint of whiskey And go singing with the band So, one of the best things about Hermosa Saloon was DQ, one of the owners and managers years ago, and Razor. Everybody in the South Bay knows Razor. Big supporter of local music, big supporter of live music, and a great harmonica player. You can also hear him on the album Demons by Big Mess. He is on harmonica on that record. So awesome. So let's do a little knocking on heaven's door.
Okay, here we are at the Pier 52 that used to be. It is now Baja Sharkies, but Pier 52, before they made it a walk street in Hermosa, you could park right in front, unload your stuff back here, go around front, hang out, park in front, park in back, wherever you wanted to park. And you could play this venue right here, Pier 52. And next door here we have Patrick Malloy's. And then I said world famous a few times. This one really is world famous. And that is right here. The lighthouse. I think I will set up back here and play you a song. And then Waterman's Grill is next door. And off in the distance there, you can see Hennessy's. All places that support live music in the underground. Awesome. All right, here we are at the Lighthouse Cafe, a place I've played many, many times. And this one really is world famous. <laughs> and this song here is called Suffer. Someone take me to the doctor so I can get some help. Don't want to live in Hollywood, don't want to be in hell. Every day is a disaster, every day a disgrace. I don't want to go to practice, I don't want to play, I suffer. Suffer. I suffer. I suffer. I never get to choose what I want to do. Don't like my situation. Don't like guarantees. People pulling me apart from every direction. Every time I'm alone, get an erection. I suffer. I suffer. Thank you very much. Okay, here we are at Pier Plaza in Hermosa Beach. 
We'll take the walk. So just imagine if this was a street you could drive on. It originally was a street which had Pier 52, had Hennessy's, and the Lighthouse Cafe. Here's Hennessy's Tavern, closest to the ocean. And we'll work our way in. We get Waterman's safe house here. And over here, this used to be the Mermaid. One of the best old bars in town. It was awesome. And next to it is the poop deck as well. And then here is that world famous Lighthouse Cafe. Many famous musicians have played here. You have jazz musicians, rock musicians, surf bands. Everybody that was anybody played there. And you have Patrick Malloy's here. In the old Pier 52, you could park right up at the curb and walk into the doors right here. Baja Sharkies, we got American Junkie. And this used to be the famous Fat Face Fenner's Falloon. Also a thing of the past. Okay, here we are at Besties. Which is the underground. It started out as Besties. He was the original owner, famous soccer player. And uh, he turned it into the underground. And then also there was an underground club inside of the underground called Reyes where they had bands, they had cool DJ playing underground music, played there plenty of times and hung out there a lot. What a cool place. Now I'm right out here in front of the underground. And you see the sign up here, fully remodeled and opening July 2nd. Oops, that didn't happen. <laughs> Hopefully they'll be open soon. This one here is called Cool City. Yes, well, do the crap. 
off to the next location. Okay, here we are. Former location of Red Onion and Beach Bum Burt's who brought the South Bay years and years of live music, seven nights a week, live music, people hanging out, having a good time, live music and DJs. Super cool. Now it's the Shade Hotel. Okay, you might have to look this one up. This is one of the famous underground clubs in Redondo Beach called the Sweetwater and next to it was the Starwood. The Sweetwater, when I was in high school, I snuck into the Sweetwater and I saw the Mystic Knights of Oingo Boingo before they were Oingo Boingo. Saw the Big Jerks here, saw the Twisters here. Look it up, it is such cool history. Many, many great bands played at the Sweetwater. Well, here we are at the world famous Brixton. I've played many a gigs here. Played with the motels here. Played with a lot of bands here. It was an awesome club. And before that, this other entrance over here. I went to this club, same thing. When I was in high school, I snuck into this club called Concerts Beneath the Sea. And I saw Spyro Gyro there. I saw B.B. King there. Amazing, amazing club. Lots of jazz bands played there, as well as the Lighthouse. And then it was a teen dance club in the uh, 80s and 90s. Played there, hung out there. Our records were played there with Easter. And now, we're looking for new owners, I think. The Brixton has been closed for quite a while. Hopefully they'll bring something back here. Awesome times, great memories. Enjoy this old video of the band Easter from back in the day. <laughs> Here's Easter on video one.
who's worked with Radio Tokyo, Ethan James. After the break, it's over to Australia. And here's a cool little bluesy club. And they also have some local bands and they let you do originals. We played in here. This is called Starboard Attitude. Right here on Redondo Pier next to the Brixton. Super fun. I'd like to thank you all for coming out and watching the show. Chad's Underground Scene, South Bay Edition. Just remember, it all starts with the underground.